This week, we were supposed to release a video talking about weapons that were seized by the Taliban. But instead, the last week and a half, two weeks, I've gotten very busy working with some contacts and former colleagues of mine to get people out of Afghanistan. Now, I was going to approach this video from the background of mine as a U.S. Army Ordnance Officer, but one who was deployed in 2012 and 13 explicitly with my unit to clear the battlefield of weapons and equipment. We were to destroy, demill, return items to inventory, or turn them over to the Afghan National Army, and therefore deny enemy access. And I was also a public affairs officer after that. This photo was taken from one of my uh, old colleagues and friends. And so I was also going to analyze the underlying propaganda value for this military equipment. I sat here for a combined, on and off combined, six hours uh, trying to film myself talking about different pieces of equipment. But at the end, as I was editing everything, it just, it felt wrong. Because yes, we lost a lot of equipment. And more importantly, we lost a lot of lives in Afghanistan. And we lost a lot of goodwill. And these are things that an ordnance officer cannot categorize or analyze for you. I think right now we should be focusing on service members, veterans, allied Afghans, and people. Now, we've decided to shelve the filming of this episode to a later date. I would still like to analyze the tactical, propagandistic, and political ramifications of our lost equipment. Maybe put some historical examples in to compare and contrast. But I think we should take some time to reflect first. Now, at the meantime, we are working on videos on things like this. And modernized Kalashnikovs. And we all still need to finish the AK-74 series part two. Now I'd like to thank my friend Tom uh, for dealing with all those agencies that he did and opening passages for many of those whom he didn't even know. And I'd like to thank my friend Callsign Apache for shepherding some of those vulnerable into safety. Well, thank you for watching. We'll see you on the range.